Chapter 4, Mishnah 2. Even when someone is forbidden by a netter to receive any benefit from the Madir, there are still certain things the Madir may do for him, because although they are helpful, they are not considered benefits under the laws of Nadarim. The next two Mishnahs list some of these permitted activities. If someone is forbidden by a neder to have benefit from another, the madir may pay the mudar's annual half-shekel donation to the temple. And if he owes someone money, the madir may pay his debt to the lender. In each of these cases, the madir is not giving him money directly, but paying a third party to spare him from a loss, which is permitted. The madir may also return his lost object, since he is simply giving back what already belonged to him. However, in a case where payment is usually taken for returning a lost object, the benefit, i.e. payment, must be given to the temple treasury.